Today we look at how to change our email on our YouTube channel. Now there's many reasons why you may be looking to do this, but just to name a few, your email got hacked. You absolutely need to do it at that point. Or you also changed businesses. You may have changed the line of work that you're doing, so you need to go and use another email. Either you are using the business email that was given to you, or you had a different domain attached to it. So you need to make the switch. But regardless of the motive, you absolutely need to get this right the first time. So make sure to stay to the end. Hey, it's Jaime. If we're just meeting, welcome to the channel that brings actionable content to grow your business through online marketing. So if that sounds beneficial, consider subscribing. All right, so here we are on our YouTube channel and in order to get to where we need to go, we're gonna go to the top right and then we're gonna go to settings. So again, we were just at our YouTube channel, we went to the settings and now we're gonna go to add or remove managers. Now you're gonna hit manage permissions. It's gonna ask you to verify. So we're gonna verify our password. And now we're gonna go back to manage permissions and then you're gonna see all of the people that you have on your channel. So all of the people that you've given access to in the past. And in order to give them the access the right way so where you can ultimately make the transfer over to them being the owner, you're gonna to go to the top right over here and you're gonna give the email that you're planning to use right there. Choose the role. You want to start off with manager first. That's really the place where you need to go. You certainly um you don't you won't be you won't want to do it through the owner part. You first need to go to the manager and you invite. Now, then you're going to get an email on the on the email of that you want to make the transfer over to. So, this is the primary account holder that you were logging into. So, this is where you used to have your channel hosted on or the primary owner in and now you're inviting the new email that you want to have be the owner. So that's that's very important. Use the same login that you've always done and now you invite somebody to become the manager. So I'm gonna log into my Gmail over here and now here's the email. We're gonna click on that and we're gonna hit accept the invitation. You see the invitation done right there, so you're gonna accept, all right? And now when you go to manage permissions, it's going to ask you to verify and now you should see the other email approved. Now, here's the thing. If you want to transfer the ownership to the other email, which is what you need to do at this point, you would go from manager and then go to primary owner, which is going to make the full transfer in order for that to happen. You need to wait seven days. So if I go to primary owner right here, you're going to see something. It's going to ask me, Hey, are you sure you want to make this a primary owner? When you hit transfer though, it's not going to allow you to do that. Primary ownership can only be transferred to the user who has been a manager for more than seven days. So you need to be aware of that. If you think that this is a thing that you can do immediately, sorry to tell you, it's going to take at least seven days. So most people are not aware of that. Make sure that you give yourself plenty of time to make that transfer, especially if you're switching jobs and you know that your email is tied to your YouTube channel. You certainly don't want to lose it. Be aware of that because most people aren't. Well, now that you know how to change your email on your YouTube channel, it's time to get back to business. So I'll leave a video right here that's gonna help you do that. Also, if you found value today, please be sure to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss another video. And of course, make it your best day yet.